at the IREX Defense Exhibition in Abu Dhabi some time ago, Highland Systems which is a company from Ukraine has launched a multi-role armored vehicle which is quite unique, Strom is the call for the vehicle. Citing from the new Atlas site, the Storm is an armored MPV with a hybrid powertrain and fully amphibious capabilities, with a submersible version coming. This is far from the first amphibious, tracked military vehicle. Russia's BT-3F and the USA's AAV-7 have been around for some time now. But the Storm is the first to take advantage of a hybrid electric powertrain, giving it an impressive 18 to 36 hour range in hybrid mode with its diesel range extender running, or the ability to operate purely on battery power for 1.5 minus 3.5 hours depending on your speed. Weighing in at around 8,000 kilograms, this versatile six-seater's 2,500 horsepower electric powertrain makes it a seriously quick performer for its category. Top speed on land is 140 kilometers per hour, and it's capable of an impressive 30 kilometers per hour in the water, two to three times as fast as larger competitors. It'll currently handle waves up to 1.5 meters. With 50 centimeters of ground clearance and durable rubber tracks, the storm can climb vertical step-ups as high as 150 centimeters, or move across a 200 centimeters wide moat. The tracks are built to be modular, reports Gordonua, so parts can be replaced instead of replacing an entire caterpillar, and this, says Highland, makes it nearly 70% cheaper to run than other models. Its armor offers protection from ballistics, mines and IEDs up to STA and AG level 1 or 2, and it can be configured to run entirely by remote control, allowing unmanned or even autonomous missions. At this stage, the storm is just a prototype. Testing and development will continue from here, and Highland says this process will include a submersible version capable of diving below the surface of water, and a wheeled version, as well as the integration and testing of standard combat modules. Company representative Alexander Kuznetsov told Gordonua that demand was looking strong and Highland plans to move to serial production.